We don't have any songs about candy, but that was awesome. That was simultaneously like very beautiful and then slowly became creepy because you just picture a grown man being like, I want candy. Which is me, I love candy. Candy's a good time. Well, you will have him. I am here. Thank you guys for joining us on a Monday night at the Painted Lady Man. Give some love to Nelson for hosting this every Monday. Back of the bar. It's a wonderful thing to have this kind of good energy, good vibes, and a place to go and just let it all out. So I am eternally grateful for that. Uh, the way this is going to work, so we're going to write a song together. I got no material. I'm a freestyle rapper. This is a totally blank slate. So what we need is suggestions of what you would like this song to be about, and then we will make that into a reality. So what would you like this song to be about? Hold on. Ladies? Fucking Pete. It's okay. Ladies, give us two seconds. Two seconds, and then you can go back to that conversation. Because when I'm up there, I can't hear anything. But while we're at it, what would you like this song to be about? Or take... Yeah, I'm taking suggestions of what this song is going to be about. We got air raids, we got light switches. Take your time. Summer sausage. Heat waves. Heat waves, yes. Chicken curry. So, so there's two things that happen. People either just yell things out, or it's like that thing where public speaking is people's number one fear, and then they go, fuck, what am I going to yell out? Is it going to be stupid? There's no stupid suggestion. So don't think too much about it. We got chicken curry, air raids, a light switch, a summer sausage, a heat wave so far. So Constipation. Constipation? Hell yeah. My beard? Very cool. Summer, summer constipation. Okay. Yes. The growth of your beard. The growth of my beard? The growth of my beard. Okay, we will go through the journey that came to be in this facialization. Oh, I'm in a hurry. 
hurry, I gotta get dinner, I need some chicken curry. Yeah. Sat down at the restaurant, it's too spicy. You probably complain about the heat, I think it's likely shit. <laughs> Same kind of people, you knew what you were getting into. Do you want real Indian food or do you want the dumbed down version? <laughs> They always say, make it like you guys eat. And then they fucking go, what the fuck did you do? <laughs> so if you're gonna embark on a journey not knowing anything, flip the light switch and live in the dark. Me, I got some better plans. I complain half the year and I feel like that might make me a better man. When it's summer, I put on my Hawaiian shirt. I go up to see some ladies and try to flirt. And they said it's so hot in here and I said check out this beard. How the fuck you feel? How the fuck you feel? to turn you on like a light switch? <laughs> Alright. Alright. Keep it low, baby. Keep it low, baby. We've got a request. Keep it low, baby. She said, I want you to turn me on. Keep me out till the break of dawn like a light switch. So all I do is just start behind the ear down her neck and then work it into the ditch. I said I get down low, always begging please, the neck, the tits, the ass, the squeeze, and then I feel so good I blow a little breeze. And she said I don't think you're getting me, I don't know the password, so I say open sesame. Thank word. But I said, man, I got the Serbian tickler. That's why I grew my beard, so I could tickle the front and the rear. And then I said, you could come and get it all over here. Just for that flavor. Ooh, I got a big one. So it's a saver. Go and ring it out in a glass, drink it like some juice, baby girl. I got that booty, you about to get loose. It's hot out, milk was a bad choice. <laughs> this cup on the other hand, shit. Savor every drop, don't wanna lose it. Never add H2O, I would dilute it. I like that concentrate, Ooh, so saturated. Plus it's got all my vitamins. Vitamin C, might have come from the D. She said I got it good, plus I got that vitamin B. Now she's turned on and dripping like a faucet. Plus it moisturizes and keeps my beard soft. It's a good shit. Natural conditioner is that. But the journey started when I saw a sprout. Thought that could grow into a beard. So I don't know. I started shaving here and then here. I heard if you shave it grows thicker and then it gets bigger and then she might let you down there if she wants you to lick her. So I grew it slowly, it was a little bit patchy, but I knew that I could do it last in the fucking Apache. And now I got competition and everybody wants a beer. Go ahead and bring it. Before it was cool, I was a trailblazer when all the other dudes were hooked on Gillette and trying to get razors. The best a man can get, I don't fucking think so. You could take that shit somewhere else. Plus, it's just easy to let a girl fuck. <laughs> but there's some assumptions people make when you grow a beard like this, especially when it gets a little gnarly and out of control. 
they said it grows and gets gnarly and gets out of control. So if this is that, then maybe down there might look like a troll. Nope. A manscape. I take care of my shit because I expect the same of my ladies that I expect of myself. Whoop! <laughs> so now I got it clean, trip and proper. So I'm a stopper. Whenever go and drop her. Draws down, go ahead and check the pubes. Go out of two, middle loop. Go ahead and get Couldn't 
give a fuck and hell, apparently I can't give a shit. I mean, really, I don't see what the problem is. The wing's overrated anyways. It just allows more things to happen and develop. Yeah. 